Midge Gillers in her grave. I taught them my tongue, those youths talented in the world's gibberish, the language that had told me no just one too many times. They drank my words, unknowing of their power to bend, break, coddle, or accuse. So skilled was I in my treacherous and heartbreaking dialect. Men swathed in lightning bolts and black leather offered me a throne upon a radio tower, its waves carrying my voice for miles. Gravelly with cigarettes and seduction, my mouth rested on the invaders' shallow, shell-shocked ears. Impersonating their mothers, I wailed over their imminent deaths and how their girls were on their backs in some boy's car. However, my threats weren't enough to keep them from crossing borders. Showered in red and black banners, I ran back to the grizzled wolf's teat, that land I thought I had escaped. The fools, they charged me with eight counts, although they were certainly ten or more, only one of which earned me a conviction by a jury of my peers, as if they couldn't count. Amongst careful habits and rosaries, I died, a passing utterly unfit for the bitch of Berlin.